Hey, what's going on, guys? It's Combo here. I'm bringing you guys a <coughs> Call of Duty Black Ops Domination gameplay here on Nuketown. And uh, sorry for not posting in like four or five days. You guys can probably tell in my voice that I'm sick. And I completely lost my voice for a couple days there. So you guys can <coughs> probably hear it in my voice. Um, I wasn't able to talk. So that's I, I, obviously you can't do a commentary then. And uh, I just wanted to uh, fill you in on what's going to happen, what's going on. And I kind of wanted to cover a topic uh, later on in the commentary. Uh, this is a 63 and 4 gameplay uh, with the Rapid Fire 74U. Um, you guys, I asked you guys way back when I posted the uh, MP5K gameplay. I think it was a TDM on Nuketown also um, with uh, the MP5K Rapid Fire. I asked if you guys wanted to see this gameplay because... Usually you guys don't want to see kind of weapons like this with with uh, rapid fire or FAMAS or AUG or something like that. Uh, but you guys wanted to see it, so I'm posting it here. It was a pretty good score, so score for Wii, I guess. Um, you know, it's always less uh, left less of a score on Wii. You know, you see Xbox guys score like 100, 100 plus. Uh, that's pretty rare in Wii. Obviously, you guys know we have less players per lobby, but uh, yeah. So I'm just letting you guys know. Um, hopefully I can get back on schedule after today. Hopefully my voice will be uh, better in the next couple of days. And uh, yeah, hopefully I can get back to uploading every day with a commentary or something else. So <coughs> I just wanted to talk about a few things. Uh, first off, you guys probably know that the uh, uh, Black Ops Wii servers were down for like a couple hours today. I uh, actually got a lot of messages saying that uh, your account has been hacked and stuff. And then... Uh, I even got a few messages where people actually deleted their whole account. They're a whole 15th prestige uh, account that they've been working on this whole time. You know, I I did that, but that was because I took a break from Black Ops for like a month. But uh, that must really suck, guys. I I would never delete my profile even if it was like hacked. If if I worked that hard on it, uh, like you guys, um, I deleted mine because quite frankly I didn't care about it. Um, but if you guys didn't care about it, then that's cool too. But uh, a lot of you guys deleted your profile I got for messages because you thought uh, it got hacked or something. But I I kind of highly doubt that you know someone would hack it. Like I said, uh, you know it's it's kind of I don't really see the point. Maybe it's definitely a possibility. You know there's a lot of hackers on this game unfortunately. Um, but I don't really see the point in bringing it down. I just think it was Call of Duty or Treyarch, Activision, whatever. I think Treyarch uh, had to do some maintenance. Maybe they had to fix a few things. Maybe test something out or whatever. Um, but yeah, guys, I, I wouldn't worry about that. Uh, it was probably just maintenance or whatever, but I played a few combat training matches. It's always fun, right? <laughs> Going one versus nine on Nuketown with, uh, you know, recruit on. It's pretty fun. So, uh, yeah, guys, so I wanted to talk about, um, is actually the, first I'll cover the community montage, how it's going, and then I'll talk about overpowered classes as I get blob shotted, uh, for the second time in a row. And, uh, yeah, so... Basically, the community montage is going actually really well. Um, I've gotten a lot of clips already, and I've gotten many triples, uh, triple collaterals, a lot of, you know, really good clips that I really, uh, I'm really looking forward to this. Uh, we got some, you know, we got the big guy sending in clips. Um, Dazran's going to send in a few. Uh, Mr. Ian15, he's going to send in a few. Uh, Lactivirus, you guys know, he's probably one of the best montage makers. Uh... And yeah, so I'm pretty excited for it. As lo as long as you guys, I mean, as well as you guys, uh, a lot of you guys have sent in clips too. You know, some some people I've never heard of. Um, I actually met a few few new people based on you know sending in clips and stuff. And uh, we even got a few really beast world at war clips. So I'm really looking forward to this. Um, hopefully, you know, there's no deadline as of right now. I'm just kind of you know feeling it out right now and, and seeing when uh, when possibly we could get this together. But right now, if we keep going at this pace, I think we, we should have it out um, right around uh, New Year's or, you know, probably early, definitely earlier. Um, I want to have it around a certain time, you know, so uh, I'll, I'll let you guys know about any updates in the future so you guys can, you know, help me out and stuff like that. So that's a pretty good update. Um, I'm just letting you guys know that. Keep sending in clips. You guys are doing great. So uh, I just wanted to talk about overpowered classes now. Um, I'm kind of using one here. Uh, a lot of people f consider this an overpowered weapon uh, if you use the uh, rapid fire attachment. And like I said in previous commentaries, rap rapid fire kind of, you know, makes kind of it's like an extra perk. It's like stopping power. Um, it basically makes the damage the the gun do more damage because the gun is you know shooting out 
more bullets a minute or a second or whatever. I don't know why I said a minute, but uh, because it's shooting faster, obviously it's going to put out more damage and you're going to get more kills or more damage out of it. So uh, a lot of people consider this overpowered. I know uh, uh, personally I thought the FAMAS and the AUG were just way too overpowered. Um, you know, so it was it's the same damage and everything, the same stats as the other systems, but what made it even more overpowered on the Wii was that uh, the Galil, the AK-47, and the Enfield actually shot slower than in other systems, and if you put a silencer on it, they shoot even slower, so, you know, you take those those three guns into consideration, they're huge on the other systems, you know, a lot they're popular, like, a lot of people use that, um, even though there are still a lot of FAMAS users, um, there's definitely a lot of, you know, AK-47 Galil and field users, and uh, unfortunately, you know, obviously because it shoots slower, more people are going to fall. Uh, fall towards the FAMAS, unfortunately, like the new players. And I think that's why uh, so many people use the FAMAS in Wii. Um, but, you know, that's definitely a gun that many people considered overpowered and stuff like that. But, wait. As for Modern Warfare 3, um, I've actually heard from a few people. I was watching Fisticuffs live stream uh, right after Call of Duty XP in the summer, I think, or right before, right after school started. Um, and, you know, he said that the UMP is definitely going to get nerfed. He said, mark his words right now, because uh, the UMP is definitely going to get nerfed, because based on what he saw, um, that was the gun to go to. I guess that was the overpowered weapon, but who knows yet. You know, you got to play the game. You got to see how people play, and you got to, like, try out all the weapons and stuff like that. Hopefully they can do a better balance of, you know, not having that, that FAMAS gun or, you know, that MP40 gun that everyone goes to. Um, I would like to see more variety in the uh, in the gun choices people use next game. Hopefully they can balance out the guns better. And I uh, hope you guys did enjoy the gameplay. Um, if you could uh, leave a rating, that would help a lot. And uh, hopefully, like I said, I can get back on schedule. Uh, I'm still pretty sick. But yeah, guys, thanks for watching. I'll see you all later, and have a good day.